what's going on guys I'm Big Yow aka Simply Gizmos and I'm going to give you a quick hands-on review of the S-View cover for the Samsung Galaxy S4. Okay so the S-View case differs slightly from the flip cases for last year's Galaxy devices by the inclusion of this window which brings some enhanced functionality which I'll cover shortly. In terms of the way that it fits the back of the case actually replaces the original back on the S4 and the front goes over the top of the device forming a protective barrier for the front with a window that gives you status information. So I fitted the case to the phone as you can see here. It's an exact fit just like the original back but with the enhancement of the cover. Now this window, this window actually provides status information as stated so it gives you call information, text messages, uh, notifications for Dropbox, Twitter, eBay, pretty much any application you've got running in the background and the screen turns pretty much off completely and is reduced to the size of the window. Now it is active so if I close the case you'll see that it flips to the smaller thing when I open the case the whole screen illuminates back up again. It's supposed to save battery power and the rest of it. To what degree that works I'm not sure but ho-hum. One major gripe, a lot of people complain that when you close the case it doesn't actually stay open when it's flat it's not too bad but if you tilt it up a little bit you can see that the case opens completely defeating the purpose of the function that it was designed for that said it does have one pretty cool function though So whilst it does indeed display caller display information and allow you to answer and reject calls with the case closed, it doesn't give you a preview for text messages, it doesn't allow you to control a media player, you can't snooze an alarm in the morning and that's somewhat frustrating because for a case that costs so much money there is a little bit of expectation in terms of value there. This case costs an eye-watering £45 here in the UK, a slightly more reasonable £30 on Amazon but it's still quite expensive. To further quantify that, the case on the left here is not an original, it is a copy, but I picked it up on eBay for about £5. £5? £30? I personally would rather have six of these. It is undoubtedly a better quality case, but six times better? I'm not too sure about that. So in closing, it's a great quality case. It has got a really nice feel to it and the additional functions that the window brings are a nice touch. Kudos to Samsung on that. However, it would be nice to see that functionality a little bit deeper integrated into the phone software so you could perhaps control the media player or something to that effect. If you did like this video, please give me a thumbs up. If you're watching this on YouTube, just below the like button there is a link to my unboxing and initial impressions of the Samsung Galaxy S4. So please feel free to have a look at that. My name is Simply Gizmos, thank you for watching, see you in the next video.